Hey everyone, this is Mashy Matrix bringing you another Let's Play Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, we managed to get a fishing rod, which is right here, and we also managed to uh, get a get a fish for a cat. In this episode, we will be collecting 30 rupees so we can get that slingshot. All right, so if we go over here and we'll talk to this guy, Link. I saw that. Calling down a hawk? Why didn't I think of that? I was trying to knock that down myself, but you beat me to it, my boy. So, he's just talking about the honey up here. Oh, I don't really want the, um... Wow. Uh, this, so I'm gonna drink the milk. I'd much rather the honey. So if we scoop... No. Oh. If we scoop... There we go. We can get... A bee larva in a bottle. Fish love these. You can eat them too with your fishing rod in hand. Use it and set. Use it with the D-pad to use it as bait. Without the rod set to it, and use it with B to eat them. And replenish a quarter heart per larva. If you have larva on your fishing rod and use it, you'll eat it. And if we climb up here, which is the main reason for knocking this down. Uh, we'll just have to climb up. It takes forever for him to climb. Uh, ivy, I guess. Just growing down a tree. Um, we'll find something at the top. So, uh, just a little talk while we're uh, playing this and getting all the items. Uh, I don't really know what I'm going to talk about, though. Uh, we'll find some rubies up here. Five for blue. Brings us up to eight. And then, ah, uh, oh, of course I'd fall. Oh my, all right. So as I was saying, um, actually I wasn't saying anything, was I? Whoops. Uh, so I'm just uh, bringing this to you in the morning. Uh, I just pretty much woke up. Um, I really don't have much to talk about. Uh, climbing up the tree again. Uh, The sun doesn't move. Or is it moving? I honestly can't tell. My eyes are going a bit cross-eyed there. <laughs> Alright, um, hmm. Let's take this again. Let's see if I fail at walking. Horrible with this thing. There we go! Ten rupees! So we're already over halfway there. Alright, let's keep going. Uh, we'll head over this way here. And let's break some of these pumpkins. Oh yeah, you have to run to throw, don't you? There we go. Oop. <laughs> there we go, another rupee! Awesome! So let's just continue on this way. And... Let's go over and talk to this guy right here. Morning, Link. Sounds like Fado's handling things at the ranch on his own today. When he's up there alone, I always figure some calamity or something else is going to happen. Whoa! A goat got loose! It's heading for town! Somebody stop it! Now what you want to do is you want to... Ah. Wow, I couldn't get that at all. What you need to do is you need to get behind it, and then hold down A to plant your feet in place. So I want to actually get this done, so we're going to talk to him again, and another one will get loose. And somebody stop it. And there we go. It's pretty easy if you actually know what you're trying to do. Clearly I wasn't the first time. Ah, uh, Fado's did it again. These goats have been awfully skittish of late. You always got to be on your toes. Sorry about that, Link, but that thanks to you, the goat didn't get away. That Fado looks like I'll be garnishing the cost of that goat for his wages. Alright, so let's, uh, let's head into this place here. This is the mayor's house. That was the mayor I was talking to. Mm -hmm. Eh? Oh, did you need Lilla or something? Sorry, Sonny, but I was told that if you came by today, I wasn't to let you inside. She's locked herself in her room working like crazy or something or other. 
So, for some reason, we're not allowed inside of their house today. So, we'll just, uh, continue along. Just gonna run through here. Oh, there's a rupee underneath the bridge. Look at that. There's the ladder I was looking for. We'll go up here. And let's see what's in this place. Okay. Climb up here. And up here. And then we'll climb up this ladder. And... Another 10 rupees. We have 31 now. Perfect. So let's head over and get our slingshot. Here we are. We'll head inside. And we will talk to her, the shopkeeper, and she looks a lot like my mother. Alright, we'll buy the slingshot. Buying slingshot, you naughty thing. You're too old for toys. Will you at least let the kids play with it? Oh, I should tell you, if you can happen to run out of pellets, you can also use pumpkin seeds. So, uh, if we run out of these 50 pellets, we can go break some pumpkins and get the seeds from that. So there's bee larva and there's milk right there. We'll just quit out because we don't need any of that and we can't afford it with our one rupee. And we will continue along. Okay. So I'm going to go and whip that to there. Switch to my hand. And now that we got the slingshot, we will go talk to the kids again. Oh. Hey. Ah, just in time, Link. I just delivered something in your room. Oh, I see you got the fishing rod, Colin. We'll be pleased. And it works better than you would think, right? Well, have a good one. Here we are. So, uh, we're gonna ignore the kids, and we're gonna go to our room. Oh. There's a bug in the way. I'll talk to these kids. Link has a slingshot. Whoa! Wow, you had enough money to buy it, Link? Alright, so this is where we learn how to uh, use a slingshot. As you can see, there's a bunch of uh, targets everywhere. And what they're going to do is they're going to ask us to fire with it. Alright. Okay, wow, this is great. Let's see how powerful the slingshot is. Hit the targets and scarecrows. I can't believe you two brats are obsessed about this. It just shows what little boys you both boys are still. These two will never let it go, Link. Just show them. First... Wow, uh, I cannot see the picture at all. My eyes are... Alright, I'll tell you what you do. You hit B, and you point the Wiimote at the screen. And it's that simple. And then you just hit B again to fire. So you can, uh... And you can move with the uh, left and right uh, the joystick. And if you hold Z, you can actually move around and target aim. Which is helpful in the end. You'll be using that a lot more than this if you're actually fighting with the slingshot. There we go. Whoa, amazing, Link. If you lock on with Z when you don't have to aim, and she's just going to tell us the same thing I just told you. Alright. Gee, you really are amazing, Link. By the way, Link, were you expecting Colin's dad to bring something by here? Because he did. Oh yeah, that's right. Was that anyway? I command you to tell us. <laughs> Love that kid. So we'll need to shoot the spider so it's off of our ladder. Give us a rupee. We'll collect that. And if I can actually get to the ladder. There we go. A little climb up. And head inside. Because in here we will be getting a new item. Here we are. We'll open it up and we get 
You get a wood sword. It was returned to you fully repaired. It's easy to use. Just swing the Wiimote. Well, let me use it inside. Alright, so we'll head out. And we'll show the kids what we got. From uh, his fa Colin's father. Here we are. Let's just head down. I'm just going to drop off. And then we talk to the kids. Oh my, isn't that a wooden sword, Link? Whoa, she's right. Hey, can I see it for a sec? Seriously, lately these monkeys have been coming out of the woods and playing tricks on us. We want to get them good. Come on, teach us how to use a sword. Yes. We're going to teach them how to use a sword. Just, just because we're nice like that, I guess. We can be nice. Alright, first off, we want to see that move. The slice. Um, you swing the Wiimote, right? So, draw it, and you just swing the Wiimote, and you slice. Wow, a horizontal slice, that was it. I think I've seen you do a vertical slice too, too before, by swinging the Wiimote while pressing Z. Alright, next. Oh, oh, I want to see that other move, Link. Yeah, the, you target with Z, and then you tilt the forward and swing. Oh, please, stab. So we'll swing with the vertical. Oh, that was so great, Link. But that wasn't a stab. What are you mumbling about? Link did that on purpose. Hey, Link, do it again. Show off how you flex your muscles and stab. So we want to move forward and swing the Wiimote at the same time while holding Z. Oh, Link, just amazing. Since you're at it, how about you show us that other move? You know, the twirl thing you do. I love it. What do you call it? A spin attack? You just lightly shake the nunchuck side to side. Just like that. Oh, wow. Thanks, Link. And that noise you heard, that's just like a uh, pause. You can't use it until you hear that noise again. Just because it would be really cheap to spin over and over again. You'd never be able to get touched. I'm sorry you have to waste your time with these little brats when you must be tired from doing all the important stuff you do. Hey, wait. You gotta show us the jump attack before you go. The one where you you go hi and leap through the air. You do that by holding A while you targeting. Go back up. And there we go. Whoa. We broke the scarecrow. Whoops. Thanks, Link. So, uh, I think I get it, kinda. Hmm. Maybe not. So this means that any time one of those naughty monkeys shows up... Ah! Wah! There's one of those naughty monkeys. Running away. Come here, you. And they all run off. Uh, we're going to stop it here for now. Um, on the next episode, we'll be chasing the monkey and the kids through the forest path. Until next time, my name again is Mashy Matrix, and uh, I'll see you guys then.